speaking. Mm -hmm. I'm Tom Schwarzdraber, Vice President of the O'Fallon Historical Society. We're at the Levi II Pickett Cemetery that I found in October of, uh, 9, of 2014. Okay. And you called me down. And he's dousing right now, which is a way of finding unmarked graves. You want to see a male. Here, I'm going to come closer to you, Tom. That's a male. I'm going to come closer. Go to the left. Okay. And then when I step over on the next three, won't go left. Oh my goodness. Because these are girls. So those will go to the right. Hmm. The last one. This is the one I had mixed signals, so I don't know if there's a child in here or not. But then when we were going with, with the pigots, when they were here, I had found these down here. And I went across. And that's grave one. Grave two, grave three, and grave four. Okay. So that's when I found out that there was more than just those front four. So how many graves are there total here? Eight. Eight. This one's going to be a male. Last one here is a male. And can you give me a general idea of, of where we are right now in O'Fallon? Like we try and remember it's on that it's on the map that I gave you. Mm -hmm. It's section bah, 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 bah. I don't remember. Without my without my computer and my, my email <laughs> that I've done done the work on. Well, what major road? We're off of uh, 159. We're off 159, and, and we're, we're east of one, Route 159, and we're north. I'm sorry, we're north of Milburn's uh, School Road. Okay. And right. since we have extra, get off there. Is it common for gro grave sites like this to go? Yes. Unknown. Well, normally somebody from the family stays with them, but this family didn't stay here. They moved uh, north. Mm. They went up to uh, they went up to Brighton, Alton area. Okay. And I just made these so that they would be marked. And even though I had these marked, when I first got here, I put these in. But these are the first ones that I put in. Okay. But I thought it would be good to have have the graves marked for the Piggott family. Mm -hmm. All righty. Well, thanks for sharing, Tom. And like I said, we are looking, west is behind us, the east is to our front. That's south and that's north. And Tom recently made contact with the the last descendants, am I correct? Yes. And how old was she? Judy's, I would, well, Judy's retired, so I guess she's in her 60s now. And how old was? Her mother's 80 something. Her, uh, Leona was really pleased that she found it. Okay. Well, it's nice to have a little history of your family. Definitely. Alrighty. So these are these new ones are a little different than what I had before, but at least they're here. Mm -hmm. Alrighty.